Hey, welcome back to my channel. Riddle here. And look what I found today. Yesterday I hit a large group of Rev Amanitas. Today, which is more normal, I found this solitary Amanita, which is one of the kind of yellow colored ones. They claim it's the same mushroom and should contain the same uh, chemicals or active ingredients that make this mushroom attractive to some people. Let's go back to edibility. It's interesting, I also read an article that the Japanese actually pickle these. They salt and pickle them to take the toxicity out. But most people aren't eating these for the flavor. They're eating them for some other kind of reason, which you can do the research about that. And if you want to do the research, this is the exact mushroom that we're looking at right now. And there it is in person, folks. I'm going to clean it up and get it over there in the dehydrator right away, as they suggest. You know what's interesting? These mushrooms, I found eight, eight or nine of them yesterday, and I cleaned them up and I got them in the dehydrator overnight, and they were still moist this morning, which is really strange. For some reason, they hold a lot of uh, moisture in them, though they don't seem like, you know, it seemed like a bolete would hold a lot more moisture than these would. I was really surprised when I pulled them out this morning and there were some of them were still a little gooey. Okay, well, there you go, people. You runs the gamut from this bright red color when you're looking for Amanita muscaria to this yellowish color. Guess they come in white too. These ones I found a lot of. This is a new one for me. And then yesterday I hit the jackpot on these. Okay, if you enjoy my videos, money saving tips, occasional art creations, rant, rave, and magic, please subscribe, it helps. You guys have a great day. Bye.